Hi, this is Ashlyn with Bellevue Avenue and I'm going to show you how to apply the twinkling bouquet overlays. And um, so the first thing you're going to want to do is just open up your picture and then go to File, Place and um, you'll choose your your overlay. And um, I'm going to choose one of the backdrop overlays. These were designed to be used in more of a studio setting on a solid background. So that looks good. I'm going to go up here and um, click the X to place it. Now I'm going to add a layer mask right here. And then I'm going to go over and choose a black brush, make sure it's soft, and at 100% opacity. Um, and then I'm going to change the blend mode to overlay. Um, now I'm going to brush all of this off using this layer mask. Um, so make sure your layer mask is selected and then start painting over the areas where you want the overlay removed. So I'm just going to go along here and brush it off his skin. And I'll be going back to um, fine tune the edges. Okay. Um, now I'm going to go back over to uh, the colors and change it to white, and then lower my opacity, and then come back to the edges and just slowly work on those to blend them. Make it look more natural. So there is the before and then the after. Um, another thing you can do is if you want to brighten or darken the um, overlay, you can add a levels layer, uh, but you're going to want to make sure to create a clipping mask over your overlay backdrop so that it doesn't affect the main layer. Um, you can do that by clicking Control alt g and then um, you can adjust the brightness here. So this is, I'm going to darken it just a little bit. So here is before and after. So that kind of makes it pop a little more. So the image before and then after. Um, and then I just wanted to show you another one using the twinkling um, overlays and these can be used on any picture um, not just studio pictures so I'm gonna go and choose one of these and when I have it where I want it I'm gonna click the check mark place it. And again I'm going to add the layer mask and then this time I'm going to change the blend mode to screen. And then get my brush, make sure it's on black, change it to 100 and then I will, making sure the layer mask is selected, brush off the areas where I don't want the effect. So I could leave it like that if I wanted to. Um, it's kind of fun. I could get rid of a little more of these. And then, um, so I can have it like that. You can lower the opacity to make it more subtle. Um, you can brush off a little bit, just a little bit, using a lower opacity. kind of blend it a little. So that's how you do the um, twinkling bouquet overlays.
So let's see, before and after. 